हेलो स्टूडेंट्स सो लेट्स कम टू नेक्स्ट सेक्शन ऑफ आवर बुक दैट इज इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ क्वांटम मैकेनिक्स बाय डीजे ग्रिफिथ वी आर एक्चुअली सॉल्विंग द होल बुक बाय स्टेप बाय स्टेप एंड वी आर इन द फर्स्ट चैप्टर व्हिच इज नेम्ड एज वेव फंक्शन एंड नाउ वी आर इन द सेक्शन 1.6 दैट इज नेम्ड एज अनसर्टेनिटी प्रिंसिपल सो इन दिस सेक्शन Uh, the heisenberg uncertainty principle is discussed and after then the problem based on them we will solve the problem based on uh, uncertainty principle so what is given into this section it is given that sigma x that is a standard deviation into calculation of random variable position into sigma px and this is nothing but the uncertainty into measurement of momentum and that must be greater than or equal to h cut by 2 so what is sigma x sigma x is nothing but the standard deviation or we can also say that is it is nothing but the error into measurement of position and which is equivalent to expectation value of x square minus expectation value of x whole square we have done this thing into last section similarly we have sigma px that is also delta px and which will be expectation value of px square minus expectation value of px whole square so these are the uncertainty principle so what is this particular thing if suppose uncertainty into position is going to increase then uncertainty into momentum will be going to decrease so what will happen if uncertainty of one conjugate variable is going to increase then other will be just try to compensate it such that in the left hand side we have some constant value so obviously if we have precise measurement in position then obviously the error into measurement of the momentum will be more but if we want to go for the precise measurement of the momentum then the error of the position will be more so we cannot have precise measurement for momentum and position simultaneously because we have very wonderful uh, principle that is known as uncertainty principle so in this section we have to use this particular principle and uh, we have to solve a different type of problem based on the uncertainty principle or the verification of uncertainty principle this is observation we have in the microscopic measurement or microscopic particle when we are using the quantum mechanical treatment to our system then we have to take care of this particular uncertainty principle thank you